What's up guys? It's XYZ and I've realized we haven't done a searching series in quite a long time. It, I, I checked and the last time I did a searching series was around two weeks ago. So, of course, we have to do it again. Oh, let me just wipe the camera. So yeah, we are in day... Oh, see, see. Oh, okay, the lighting. Okay, wait. Hello. Okay, why can't my camera focus? Okay, we are in day 18, guys. Yes, oh, no, not 18, I'm sorry. Day 8 or day 9. I, I'm sorry, I keep forgetting to check. But yes, that means we have reached 8 days of failure. 8 days of failure to find Slime Obelisk, as you can see here. This is the card that we want to get, but the card that we haven't been able to get. <sighs> And as always, it's been such a failure. So who knows, today on day 8, which is technically it's been a week, so who knows, we might be able to pull Slime Obelisk. So let's go. Day 9 or day 8 of Rage of Ra, Legendary Duelist. Let's go. No delays. Let's open it up. Come on, come on. Give me some good cards. Ugh, nice smell, as always. So yeah, what could it be? The first card we got is Token Stampede. Very nice. All tokens in attack position gain 1,000 attack. Also, they cannot attack, cannot be destroyed by battle. Nice. Okay, this is one of the few cool, cool cards. We got Brain Control. I mean, this is kind of iconic, right? Very old school classic. I, did, I didn't expect to get Brain Control in this pack. But yeah, it's nice to see that we get this. P800 life points. The target one phase up most of your opponent control. That can be normal summon set. Take control of that target until the end phase. Whoa, I always like this design, man. This is real, so cool that you got a brain here and then got some evil eye. Because the name of the card is literally called Brain Control. So that's why you control a brain. But yeah, honestly, back in the days, this was one of my favorite cards. You just use this card to control other cards, you know? The third card we got is, oh, okay, I've never seen this one. Clearly, we got the face of Jinzo right here. So, clearly, this card is Jinzo related card. So, let's see, it's Amplifier. Let, let's read it. Um, equip on to Jinzo, this card activation and effect cannot be negated. The grip monster's effect, trap card and other effects on can be activated. Okay, because the uh, this seems complicated. I, mean, I don't even know. Is this good? God, I'm not even sure if this card is good or not. But yeah, let's skip it. Oopsie daisy. And then we got Maclord Astro Mechanical. Mechanical. I think that's how it's supposed to pronounce it. It's this weird spelling. I've got this card before, so nothing surprising. Uh, it's very long, very scary, very weird, and a very apparently very powerful, but God knows. Maclord Astro Mechanical. And the final card, could it be... Could it be Slime Obelisk? Could it be Slime Obelisk? No, it's not. It's a rare Mound of the Bound Creator. Level 10 or higher monsters on the field cannot be targeted or destroyed by a card's effect. If a level 10 or higher monster destroys a monster by battle, sent to the graveyard, the player who controls the card just takes 1000 damage when they discard the spell. Blah, 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 blah. You can just set one divine monster from your deck to your hand. So you can use this to summon Obelisk, I guess. I don't know. Because Obelisk is a divine monster, and this one you can use. To summon a divine monster, so presumably he uses to summon obelisk. <sighs> another day, another failure, guys. I don't know why we keep failing. I think this is the longest time it takes us. Uh, uh, previously, I I done this to pull Ra, and Ra only took me like what three days. Oh my god, three days, and I only got final version of Ra. <sighs> but this time we are taking a long time, guys. We are on day eight, and we still haven't been able to pull slime obelisk. Another day, another failure. But who knows, we'll get it next time. Okay guys, that's it for this video. It's been XYZ and thank you for watching. Bye.